You want to call the police on them for having a barbecue on a and Sunday? You're going to feel free! Back off! I'm going to tell them there's an African-American man threatening my life. And your nose bleeding. Yeah. <laughs> you getting arrested. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Young man, where you from? Where the you from? The Bahamas. My number is 7519. What do you want me to do? Wipe your nose? <laughs> She's a real soldier. <laughs> Boom, boom, clad up. Let's go, bloody nose. Can you go this way? Oh, you ain't got that. It's crazy. Look. Oh, you can kick him in the head. Oh, mate. Man. Hey, bro, you picked the wrong job, you know, soldier. You realize that? Now the rest is okay. Oh, Now you under arrest and she getting away. Soldier, now she getting arrested. Not me. <laughs> okay, these are UK Karens. Listen, there's more. It gets even deeper. These UK Karens are at the City of Spice Indian restaurant. Here's the next video. Look, see, say help for them. She just help you. Don't get caught. Oh my God, I want to run. <laughs> she <'cause> she's running. <laughs> He going somewhere else. Look, he going to another scene. <laughs> that dude got something else going on, and you about to run. Go oh save your friend, in it. <laughs> oh, mate. No. Oh, mate. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, help, help your friend, dog. Them boys doing something else. Oh, uh, now you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> now you now. Oh, that's some G right there, G. That guy's the Oh, you gone. Uh, well, let me first say big ups to the narrator because without his commentary, I would have been completely lost about what's going on. Um, this was in the UK. You saw everything. Just as I saw it, all right? Now, there's something you may have missed. When the cop came in with the low kick, uh, can we play that? We got it in slow motion. Nah. Oh! 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 Yeah. Um, he actually kicked her out of her shoes. Now, He's under investigation for excessive force, okay? This is how it goes down in the UK. Um, they fought the police, they were aggressive and violent. They made a scene in the restaurant. They still got apprehended, nobody got shot, nobody even got tased. Attorney, when I saw this, I said, okay. Uh, this cop is about to get really mad and start doing some very, very violent things. He's gonna end up pulling out a taser or physically being aggressive. I mean, what are your thoughts? It's a different situation. Yeah, I thought the same thing. That it's so much more innocent. You know, the fact that it was a kick that he, they're getting investigated for. Yeah. You know, I lived in Spain for a time, and I never felt safer. There's no guns around. People don't have guns. The police don't have guns. It's completely a different situation, and the police there um, behave differently because they don't. Think anybody has guns? They don't have guns. There's not this like violent um, expectation or mentality. It's 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 too bad. We should be able to have that here, but we don't. Yeah, and I think for us to really analyze how we got here in this country with the amount of violence we have, with the amount of crime, police misconduct, we have to look not only at the culture but also the founding document. And until we're willing to challenge some of the principles of the founding document of this country, we will never get to a remedy of the new country we're trying to become.